Microbeads are a common ingredient in cosmetics, even toothpaste. The tiny particles may look harmless, but as Laura Zilke tells us, while they claim to add some polish to your look, they're also doing a lot of damage. Meant to enhance your beauty routine, those tiny microbeads you use to scrub and soften your skin for a few seconds are washing down the drain and leaving a much longer term effect in our Great Lakes. They're too small to get caught by sewage treatment plants, so they, they're discharged right into our rivers and our lakes. Microbeads are found in dozens of cosmetic and beauty products, largely body scrubs that advertise the beads as exfoliants. The minute particles are also found in some toothpaste. They've been added to add some pizzazz to the product uh, for, for cosmetic purposes only. Hygienists have seen them in healthy human mouths trapped as foreign particles in one's pink gums. Those microbeads were placed several areas in the mouth. It wasn't just one particular spot. So what are microbeads? Well, they're actually tiny little balls of plastic, most commonly made from a substance called polyethylene. That's the same kind of plastic used to make shopping bags, even things like your waste bin. A single tube of body wash contains as many as 330,000 microbeads. They're so small, they wash through sewage treatment plants and clean into our Great Lakes. We got samples in Lake Ontario of up to 1.1 million plastic particles per square kilometer, and that was right outside of Toronto. The issue is long term. Since microbeads are plastic, their lifetime is considered between 500 and 1,000 years. Started analyzing various fish and aquatic bird species, and and looking to see if the plastics are actually making their way into and migrating up the food chain. And they, they spoiler alert, they are. Health Canada says manufacturers cannot sell any cosmetics that may cause injury to health. The effects in this case are considered environmental. There are no Canadian government agencies considering the ban of microbeads. Some manufacturers, including Crest, have committed to removing microbeads from their products, but not all are on board. Laura Zilke, Global News.